All right. Oh, hey, we get to hear the gourmet race theme again. Yep, here we go again. Ah, oh, shit, here we go again. This freaking. Oh, never mind. Or not. I swear, of all the animal friends, can't. The owl is the freaking one of the most broken. Yeah, now. With this wind, forget about it. He's going to be super helpful here. Oh, what's KDL3, uh, Super Chris? I don't even know what game that is. I'm kind of curious. I'm kind of in the mood. Yeah. Yeah, look at this. Fucking broken. All we have to do is just let the wind carry us. That's it. Easy strats. Uh, hold down the button to win. Hold down the X button to win. Or not. Now let's not take our chances. Yeah, no, I can't be flexing like that. Always be one of my favorite Kirby themes, like in the entire franchise. Between this, King Dedede's theme, and Meta Knight's Revenge. I don't even know. Was this did it, did this theme originate in this game, or did it originate in Kirby Superstar? Because I feel like it originated in Superstar, and then it came over to Dreamland Three. I honestly can't tell though, I don't really know. And I gotta be stupid careful about... gotta do much just let I'm just gonna let him jump to me that's how you guys do I have a minute to give myself a breather yo you can easily cheese this boss just by standing here in the corner That's what I thought. I thought this appeared in Superstar first. Have hey, we got another life though? No. I want my broken thunder. This is so broken. I love it. Oh shit. Ah! Well, not broken enough apparently. All right, we gotta go back to normal strats. That's all right. Oh yeah, I think I might have pointed this out in, the, in a previous uh, segment, but I thought whenever Kirby jumps, he like taunts. In this game.
All right, gotcha. Oh, they look cute together. See, Chris, I give you a lot of credit because I don't even remember. I don't even remember like half the characters in this game, and I don't even know any of the animal buddy names except for Rick, because I remember his trophy from Melee. In terms of Smash Brothers. Yeah, I figured that there would be a theming with the one. That's the one thing I've noticed about this game. There's always one mini game level, one level where you have to bring one of the animal friends to the end of the level, one of them where you have to build something by breaking bricks in one of the rooms, and another one where you're just helping out flowers. That always seems to be a theme in like every single world so far. Wait a minute, Rick's not in this level then. So how am I supposed to get him? Well, I have to go to another level and find him and then go bring him back here. Ah, he's gotta be so they gotta have him somewhere in here. I highly doubt that, because usually with these levels. There he is. I had a feeling he'd be somewhere. They all they, al they always end up putting the character you're looking for in these levels. Now, now I just gotta not lose Rick, which is gonna be stupid hard now, cause... I'm like, low low on health. Oh god, I I'm like, a little nervous. Alright, hold on. That sort of helps. And that sort of doesn't help, but alright, I guess that's a better way to do it. And you know, that was probably a better move. Because I know for a fact he's up. Oh, wait a minute. Did, uh. Oh, hold on. Now I think I ended up losing the spot where he was. And if, if, I, if I don't see him in the next room, then... Yeah, no, I already lost him. Let me go back. Alright. Okay. I just gotta remember with Rick, there's no double jump with him. Like, Nago is completely broken in the cat because he has like a triple jump and he's fast. And Kush has got like unbelievable air ability. And unless you do it in an aquatic level, the fish is useless. Then everything else. Yeah, the octopus is okay. Yeah, he only has one jump. I'm gonna take this nice and slow then. Oh, that was a little too close.
Oh, he can climb up the walls. All right. Oh, I'm a little afraid here. Yeah, this is the level that's going to freaking break me, I think. <laughs> yeah, this level's not going to be that fun. Well, I could jump on those waddle things. Yeah, I don't know if... I don't know if I could legit... I didn't know I could le legitimately jump on those, because those things always give problems, but... Screw it. I'm going to go for it, then. I was just going to land on the first platform and hit the other ones. Hold on, do you give a special power? No, you don't. Alright. I know that enemy gives Archer later on, but... Oh, I couldn't jump on a lot of stuff. I didn't realize that. And also, you can climb walls. That makes things a little bit easier. Alright. Oh, screw it. Now that I know that... All right, easy cake, hard foot. Not in the girls, I know that now, but Yeah, this is scaring the hell out of me. I feel like I'm taking leaps of faith here. Oh, uh, and I gotta deal with these things too if I get hit, that's it. Or not. I don't like this. Oh, thank God we made it. Yeah, that scared the crap out of me. I gotta go make hamster kisses. All right. All right, that was a little frustrating, but all right, once I got the timing down and jumping on the little puff balls, that was all right. All right, this one, I already remember what you have to do with this because I've seen another one of these. This is one of the ones where I'm going to have to go find something to make the shape. That wasn't too bad once I figured out that you could jump on those little guys, though. Yeah, no, that scared the crap out of me, though. I'm not going to lie on that. I'm not going to say that was piss easy. That wasn't. Not by a long shot. Over here, you freaking weird shadow thing. All right. Thank you. Over here. Hey, Hero with another 100 bits. Thank you, buddy. All right. Do that.
Uh, yeah, screw it. No, actually, no Noggle's gonna be a better choice. Let me go through it with the, with the, with this with the cat. Go in there. Let's screw it. I want I want to build. I want to. No, hold on a minute. No, hold on. Now will just freaking that whole entire thing. Watch out for Pelico. He's that camouflage monster that attacks with his tongue. Alright, we're gonna speed run this. Nope. Oh, I'm gonna stand to the side. There it is. I feel like this might be the room. Now, see, that's the shape I have to make. All right, so. I know that's upside down, though, so it's, a, it's basically a T and then like more of a key shape towards the top. All right, I got it. I got you, fam. As soon as I legit could get. All right, I don't want to get my ass completely handed to me. Alright, you I, I need a legitimate get off of you because this is gonna be I feel like maybe I already messed this up, but I don't even know. Nope, I did already. Hold on. Let me uh, look at it. All right, so it's five, three, one, one, three. All right, I got it. Five, three, one, one, three. All right, so, ah, already fucked it up. All right, so that. That, that. Alright, messed that up. Alright, I gotta do it upside down though. Three, one, one, three, five. No, hold on. Top one is supposed to. I hang on. Three, one, one, three, five. So. Yeah, I gotta be careful with that. Three, one, one, three, five. Three. So this is like a fucked up game of Picross. Alright, three. <laughs> fucked up again. Let me do it this way then. Now I just gotta.
I think it's the other way around. Uh, yeah, no, nah, I think it's the other way around with this. I think it's this way. Shouldn't I hear the chime go off when I got it? Oh, it's five three one one three. Five three one one three. That's what I thought. No, hold on, I got it now. That's what I thought. I, I knew I was doing it wrong. All right. I'm gonna get it, don't worry, just a little bit of patience. There it is. That's what I thought it was. Alright. It was him upside down, so I figured it had to be the other way around. Oh shoot, no, I wanna finish this level at least. I really hope I don't lose my progress now because of this. That should be good though. No, I know I shouldn't because I, I passed the room at least. I should hit the check. I should have gotten the checkpoint. There it is. Ah, uh, all right. I realized what I did wrong there. Never mind, I fucked that up too. All right, we're good. Fuck, I don't need any of that stuff. I'll get something at the finish. I hope. Alright, come here and knock these out. Thank you. I still got three lives. I'm alright. Yeah, I would have been able to heal up there, but that's all right. I like the fact that these drawings are coming off the walls. I think I know who might be the next boss then. Maybe I do anyway. I don't even know. All the way. Ah, all right. I still we got it. Oh, yeah, Adeline. Yeah, see, I remember that line from Kirby 64 and the Crystal Shards because they had their own boss battle. I can't remember. Because I'm pretty sure that line ends up firing the paintings at you and stuff. Pretty dope. That line was a really cool idea. Right. This thing. This also came back in Kirby 64. That line's big sister. That's really cool, though. All right, get mad.
I wasn't really prepared for that, but that's alright. There you go. Yeah, get mad. Oh shit, Mr. Shine and Mr. Bright. Oh, that's cool. I didn't know they originated from this game because I remember them in Kirby's Return to Dreamland on the Game Boy Advance. Oh, it's cool seeing these guys. Actually, I think they might have been Kirby Superstar also. I don't. No, these guys are Kirby Superstar also. That's cool seeing them here too, though. I love Mr. Shine and Mr. Bright. They're both pretty cool. Oh, give me a break. Alright, yeah, this boss fight's gonna be a little bit of a... Uh... Kirby's Adventure and Dream Course in the original Kirby's Adventure, right? All right, yeah, I gotta be careful with this then. I can't like let myself get hit too much like I did on the first boss. All right, I know Alan's gonna have three phases, so I gotta be extra careful here. I say that as soon as I get hit. Alright, there you go. That's phase, that's phase one. Right, I can handle this thing now because I know the pa I know the attack pattern of this. I never seen this after this game though. I don't even know what this guy is called. Alright, yeah, fire fire your little pew pew missiles, your little pew pew beams. Alright. I did not mean to swallow that, I was just trying to run. Alright. Alright, I gotta be Well, we're doing good, I only got hit once. So Mr. Shine and Mr. Bright shouldn't be too bad. Oh, dope. All right, so Mr. Bright's already done. Sun, sun, Mr. Golden Sun, get the fuck out of here. Get out of here with that. Kirby, use solar beam. It's super effective. Oh, really? You're gonna send? Oh, I hate this guy. Man, fuck Krakow. Really? Krakow's in this boss fight too? I can't fucking stand Krakow. Krakow's like one of my least favorite bosses in the entire Kirby franchise. I really- Yo, Krakow gives me anxiety every time I see him as a boss fight. All right, throw out your little. All right, throw out your little cloud minions. Enough of the freaking. All right. I don't like him. Really? Yeah, how are you hanging on by a half a health bar? Really? 
Bruh. Hey, no, I'm not having this. Get back here. Thank God I'm done with you. Sorry, Adeline. Uh, getting all the dark matter sucked out of the world here, too. Good shit. Not bad. World 4 completed. I will gladly take that. 